Hello everybody, today we're back in Mega Man X. And so today we're going to be using the password feature, but also you may have noticed that the screen you have is a little different. Yes, that is the first boss we're going to be going through instead of Mega Man. So, now I will pull up my handy dandy little code that I put in the last one. And so, hold on. Okay, so it is. Hmm. Okay. Cool. So it is five. So the Y and B buttons make it go up and down. So five, three, two. Or I mean eight, two. Five three eight two eight six 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 yes I know that's okay four six five six and end. Okay, so we're back to the first part. Now, before we actually fight, um, what is it? Um, launch Octopus, we are going to f go to this stage. We're not going to complete it first. But we're going to go get an upgrade. So, we are not going to fully complete it. We're just going to go get the upgrade. Uh, this part's always a little hard for me. Never mind. Okay, so now we're getting a little bit closer to where we should be. Now you don't want to let, so there's going to be these rolling balls, right? They're going to keep coming. And so, yeah, you're going to just keep going up this pathway until you get fully up there, which we're about to do, actually. I think this is the last thing we have to kill. Alright. Until you come to this thing. And now, conveniently, so you've come. X, I gave you the ability to choose your own path in life. And I hoped the world would allow you to choose a peaceful one. But now it seems that you ate that you are destined to fight because I thought the world might need a new champion I have hidden capsules like this one if you find and use them you will be able to increase your powers beyond anything the world has ever known step into this capsule and receive an acceleration system to boost your speed. Good luck, X. Alright, so we're gonna do just that. And now this is gonna seem really stupid what we're gonna do after this. But... It works, trust me. So that's like a little small boost. And now, I am intentionally doing this, by the way. Because we won't die, because, well, we'll die, but we'll still have the boots, including if we don't finish the level. So, just to make it easier, we're going to get this upgrade. We're going to die intentionally. 
And then we are going to go back to the first stage in which we will actually fight the boss. So, yeah. Alright, you got three lives for each stage. And so, yep. That's not the password for this episode, don't worry. But now, we go to the real fight of this episode. Launch Octopus. This is about as far as I got, by the way. So a little trick you can do with this, uh, uh, what is it, with these new boots, is that, especially in this level, it helps a lot. It helps especially in this level. It is not only crucial, it's crucial to learn this, so... Yeah, you can step in the... You can go really far... Ah! Yeah, that's what he looks like when he dies. Um... You see, when you're in the water, and you have these boots, they provide extreme mobility. Alright, so as I said, Mega Man gets extreme mobility, especially in this stage, with those boots. So that's why I highly recommend doing that one little trick I showed you. Now, this is a little submarine. Just gotta jump like this. And then he's gonna have this stuff that you're supposed to avoid. Like I said, I am not the best at this game. Come on! Ah. Uh, of course, this doesn't ever help. Alright, cool. Got through that part. Finally. Ugh, why can't I ever just not die? Oh my god! Really? Don't worry, we're going to get through this episode. Alright. Cool. <sighs> Let's do this. Oh my god. Finally! Oh god, I really hope I get help back. Oh, thank god. Okay. Finally. Yeah, just essentially avoid this this stuff and then just 
keep firing like this, and you'll eventually defeat it. There! And it drops a bunch of health packs, as we're supposed to. Uh, these guys will try and suck you in if you... If you try and... If you get near them, they'll try and suck you in. Just avoid them. And we see this again. Except this time you're right next to Spikes. How convenient. For him, at least. Ugh! Well, at least this is a halfway point. Right? Okay, yeah. It's a halfway point. Oh my god, that is the worst death ever. Well, not ever, but... Seriously, how did I let that happen? Come on, blow up. I don't have forever. Come on. Okay, there we go. I think this is the one that... Okay, those are all the health packs. Okay, so those are the twisters. And as I said, the dash thing gives you a lot of mobility. And we are almost to the boss, fortunately. And so he will appear certain places. Uh, you can also get on top of him. He'll bury himself in certain areas. He'll pop up. And he'll also appear on whatever side you're on. So if you're on the other side of the screen, he'll... Uh, uh, okay. I always find it to be more convenient to go on this side for some reason because it's a little easier for me to aim. And when he's on low health, he will start to uh, just chase after you. He won't just bury back, he'll just straight up chase after you. Now, some parts of him won't actually deal damage to you. So, yeah. Now, I've never actually beat the first boss of this game. I know, I know. It's really bad. Like, I told you, I am really bad at this game. But, the goal is, by the end, we're not going to be bad. That's the goal, at least. And I will at least finish the Let's Play. Okay, there, he's exploding. And so now we can continue to the final boss room. Hopefully, one of you guys will drop a health pack, maybe. Uh, okay, maybe not. Well, at least we made it this far. Alright. Alright, this episode's getting a little long. If you want to continue, there's your password. If you guys enjoyed this episode, then please leave a like, etc. And, well, we'll have a rematch next episode.